powerful, powerful quake has hit a mega quake in Tonga, very near the American Samoa, a 6.9, which was later downsized to 6.8 by the U.S. Geological Survey and very shallow, has sparked fears of tsunami. Now, we know that the solar winds have been coming off the sun at 400 and 43 kilometers per second right now. And there was already high concern of that the CMEs and the solar winds, the ultraviolet rays and all of the cosmic rays pressure that would hit the earth would cause or trigger a mega quake. And I brought this up uh, during my live show yesterday. Well, it has happened. American Samoa, huge earthquake, uh, Tonga, sparking fears of a tsunami uh, in the Ring of Fire area. Matter of fact, the quake had a depth of 32 kilometers, and uh, it has brought a lot of concern. Now, President Donald Trump is in Hawaii getting ready to fly to Japan, so we know that uh, even though he's, he's okay, the, the fact that the Ring of Fire is not okay, and there's a lot of pressure building. Early reports suggest that the quake was also felt in Tonga. Well, yes, it was. It was closer to Tonga than American Samoa, but it was really right in between them there, very close. Uh, 6.8 mega, mega earthquake. The Pacific Tsunami Warning Center confirmed earlier today there was no threat of a tsunami, but at first it triggered fears. The Simona Meteorological Service excuse me, said that the earthquake had occurred in the Samoa region. And this is November 4th. Now, there's other, besides earthquakes, we're more concerned about a massive blackout drill throughout America that has been talked about and even scheduled by some of the uh, Department of Defense and other agencies. Now, these would be random blackouts in random cities for a drill in case that we had our power grids fried, okay? Now, this blackout drill is supposed to go between November 4th and November 6th. We have no reports of any blackouts. And the other concern people have is this Antifa has declared today, November 4th through November 6th, a time for a civil war, rallies, or violence. They've even declared civil war. So we're going to see how this all plays out over the weekend. But right now, it is the earthquake that's the greater concern, and we'll keep an eye on all of the earthquakes. Now, matter of fact, just so you know, since that quake hit this morning, 6.8 Tonga, we had a 4.1 earthquake in Ecuador, a 5.5 in New, New Caledonia, still shaking, a 4.9 in Indonesia, a 4.4 earthquake also hit in Greece. We had a 5.0 again in Tonga, 4.7 in Japan, a 5.6 in New Caledonia, a 5.3 just now hitting New Caledonia in the last two minutes. So there's definitely a lot of shaking and quaking, and the earth is definitely breaking, and uh, we're in the last days. So give your life to Jesus Christ. I'll keep you up to speed with all the current events today. We'll keep a close eye on Antifa and scheduled blackouts. And just see if any of that develops and pray none of it does. Are you serious?